this is the iphone x one of the very best phones apple has made but i'm very tired of this phone this phone needs to go are you listening damn Okay, so first of all, if you use an iPhone X, then what you need to do is to take your iPhone X to the nearest Apple service center and they are going to replace this for free. Now, there are some caveats, okay? One, if you don't have like any crack on your iPhone X screen, then you can do it for free. But if there's a crack, you need to pay for the cost of the repair of the crack before you get your ghost touch fixed for free now they'll replace your screen so you need to back up your iphone right now if you don't use an iphone x apple acknowledges the ghost touch issue but they do not acknowledge it for any other model of iphones and this is like the second video i'm doing about this ghost touch series people who are using iphone 12 iphone 11 pro max and all different ranges of iphones are reporting the same issue so before i even continue with the video i want you to go into the comment section and comment the iphone that you use the model is it an iphone 12 is it an iphone 6 and then also which version of ios you are using and when you first started observing this ghost touch issue let me know in the comments and then we'll go to the rest of the possible workarounds for fixing this ghost touch issue coming up next okay so someone might ask what if i'm not using an iphone x what if i'm using an iphone 11 or an iphone 12 or even earlier models of iphones well if you're able to take it to the apple service center depending on the country you're in and get your phone to demonstrate the ghost touch issue then you qualify for you know at least maybe a little charge on the screen replacement program so i've had people in the comment section of my previous videos who said they took it and it was replaced for them but at a very small cost though they were not using iphone x so you can also try that option and see because apple says this about their replacement program for the iphone x models okay now if you go to the official apple website they say iphone x display module replacement program for touch issues apple has determined that some iphone x displays may experience touch issues due to a component that might fail on the display module an affected device may exhibit the following the display or part of the display does not respond or responds intermittently to touch. The display reacts even though it was not touched. Apple or an Apple authorized service provider will replace the display module on eligible devices free of charge. No other iPhone models are part of this program. Now, another workaround which was suggested by one of my viewers in the comment section was touch accommodation. So to use the touch accommodations feature, all you need to do is to go on your iPhone, right? And then go to settings. Once you go to settings, you go to accessibility. When you go to accessibility, you click on touch. When you click on touch, you go to touch accommodations. Initially, it's going to be off, you turn it on, then you scroll down to ignore repeat, you turn it on, and then you increase it to 0 0.10 seconds. And once you do so, many people have reported that that's automatically fixed their issue for them. So I want you to try that right now and let me know if it works for you in the comments below. I have tried that touch accommodations thing. It doesn't work on my iPhone X, so it might not work for you. Another workaround I have is when the ghost touch is happening, I just, you know, like turn off the screen. Once I turn off the screen, I just wipe it a bit. And the moment I turn it on, it just stops acting up for some time. But it's a very temporary solution, right? It's not a permanent solution that you can say, oh, for the next 10 years, your iPhone is going to be bug free. No, 
it might go for a day or two even a week or even an hour but then it's definitely going to come back so that's a very temporary fix the next thing that people have said helps them to fix the ghost touch issue is to restart their iphones i know many of us we hardly ever restart our phones we use it all the time when the battery is low we charge it we keep using it and the thing about iphones is that they usually have very small memory so like an iphone x could have like three gigs of ram whilst an equivalent Samsung Galaxy S9 Plus or something could have like 8 gigs of RAM or 6 gigs of RAM, you know. So because the memory is small, the RAM is small, RAM management comes into play. And when you open multiple apps, you begin to see the ghost touch effects happening. So all you can do is to, you know, close all your open apps and then restart your device and you should be fine. Some people have said that that's works for them now some people have also said that doing a factory reset worked perfectly for them they never experienced it again now for me the most important thing for you to be able to fight this you know ghost touch issue is to identify when and where it happens right so for me when i'm using like facebook or Twitter, those are the applications which seem to trigger the ghost touch effect a lot, especially Twitter when I open an image. Or like if I have a very low battery, then I begin to see that the ghost touch happens. It doesn't usually happen when my battery status is green, like 100%, 80%, but when my battery percentage is like 10% and stuff like that, it's going to ghost touch all over the place. So you need to try and figure out which circumstance it happens now i also noticed that when i put my phone like flat on a surface it tends to happen a lot but if i prop it up you know um, vertically to even record whilst it's happening to show to people that oh this is what my phone does then it stops all of a sudden it's a it's a pretty weird phenomenon and so that's those are some of the fixes that i have observed that people have also contributed in the comment section now if you want to hear me talk about my experience under ghost touch you can stay on for the rest of the video but if you came for the fix and you found it you can leave the video but if you're new to my channel i do mobile phone reviews mobile app reviews and i bring to you affordable gadget reviews to help you make an informed decision when you are making your next purchase so if you like that kind of content then please click on the subscribe button turn on all notifications so you do not miss any episode now if you try all these options and it doesn't work for you you can do like me and you know flash your phone like throw that piece of garbage in you know the rubbish dump you know you can you can you can throw it i mean the phone has been frustrating me like sometimes i'll be watching people's statuses or i'll be on telegram or i'll be on whatsapp and before i realize it has placed a video call you know and it's very embarrassing because it can call somebody on video call at maybe 1 a.m midnight and stuff like that and what if the person is like a married woman and your phone is calling the person accidentally the person's husband might think you are the the wife is cheating with you why are you doing a video call with somebody at midnight yeah and i've also had it attempting to call my exes in fact sometimes when i leave my phone unlocked i see it's beginning to type messages and stuff like that and it can even resign on on your behalf to your corporate organization because when i leave my mailbox open and i come back i see it composing mails and all manner of crazy stuff yeah sometimes i'm playing candy crash and this game wants to move the tiles and stuff like that it's just insane it's just ridiculous yeah i don't know how you experience yours but it's so frustrating for phones which cost so much this is an iphone x and i'm using an iphone 11 pro max to record this video and these phones are pretty expensive and when you experience this ghost touch thing you can't use your phone at all it's so damn frustrating so i want us to leave a comment on the type of device you are using type of iphone you are using and the ios version when you first started observing this ghost touch so that we can have like you know a scientific method of sending feedback to apple that hey you need to extend your iphone x replacement program to other iphone models because the ghost touch is not just on iphone x at all okay now another thing i've noticed is that this iphone ghost touch issue tends to happen a lot when there's a new release of ios like 
I first observed my when I moved to iOS 13. Before then, I was perfectly fine perfectly fine but once i moved to ios 13 i started experience ghost touch on my iphone x some people experience this when they move to ios 14 and now with ios 15 coming up i am very sure people who whose phones were working perfectly are going to start experiencing the same thing in fact i have downloaded the beta version of the ios 15 right and i'm experiencing the same thing so i can guarantee that people who are using iphone 12 12 pro 12 pro max even maybe their latest iphone 13 which is going to come also going to experience the same thing if you know someone who is having this issue you need to share this video with a person let a person know that it's it's a real issue a person is not alone in this we are all suffering together and the more knowledge we contribute the more we can put apple you know to get them to fix this particular issue finally if you have like a second device to record your iphone x ghost touching i'll be grateful if you could do so and then send me that video on instagram my handle is cyber reviews gh on instagram but i'm going to leave the link in the description box as well so that i do a compilation of iphones misbehaving so that at least people will see that apple sees that it's not just an iPhone X issue, but the program needs to be extended to all other versions of iPhones, provided people are complaining about this ghost touch effect. Thank you very much for watching, and I do hope that this helped you in some way. If you found a solution, which is not going to be you spamming the comments, you can also leave that in the comments below, because it might be helpful to someone else. Thanks, Bibri.